We can find some work to do now that we've made our guild. Easy, Tiger. So, Estelle, what are you gonna do? I want to go looking for that talking monster. If it was me he was after, I want to find out why. Don't feel like you'll be able to rest easy till you find out, huh? But how will you do that? How can you look for a monster if you have no idea where it is? I thought you were in charge of all the monster-related information. Don't ask me! Even I've never seen anything like that before. That was no monster. His name is Pharaoh. Do you know about him? I saw him earlier when I was traveling with my friend, and it was my friend who knew his name. Why would your friend know the name of something like that? Where did you see it? It was on the Desier continent, in the sands of Kogor. That's the continent to the southwest of Tolbikia. The continent of Desier. The desert. You don't just go marching off to a desert because someone saw a monster. He's right, you know. I wonder if that fairy tale could be... Fairy tale? Something I read at the castle. A tale about a monster that speaks, who lives in the sands of Kogor. There are always stories like that. Like the one about the monster in the sea who talks to people. I think you've got it backwards. Backwards? Such creatures do exist, but they have simply become the stuff of legend. It's like the saying, where there's smoke, there's fire. Yeah, but are you thinking of going all the way to a place like that alone, Estelle? Huh? Well, I... If we don't keep up this little bodyguard operation, she'll really march off on her own. What do you think? Let's take this as our first guild assignment. Hey, you're right! We'd be breaking our own laws if we let her go alone. That's right. But if this is a real job, we'll have to charge Estelle our fee. Well, we don't need to worry about something like money, right? Nope, no exceptions. Money is a necessity for running a guild. Um... I'm afraid I'm a bit short on funds at the moment. In that case, why don't we just figure something out later? I'll pay the fee, I promise. So let's all go together. Okay, looks like that settles it. This way we can all continue the journey. All right, super ultra courageous braves, fall out! W what is that? Huh? That's our guild's name! We can't go with that. We need something easy to say that has a real snap to it. Oh, really? Well... How about something like... Brave Vesperia. It's the star that gives off the brightest light in the night sky. The brightest star! Cool! Brave Vesperia. Hmm. Huh. I like it. Let's stick with that. Okay, that settles it. Let's get to Torum Harbor and charter a boat. We're off on an ocean voyage to the continent of Desier. Didn't you want to take a break at Halyard? Ah, uh, who needs it? 
Either way, we can't get to Torum without passing through Heliord. I'd also like to see how they've been doing since the Blastia went out of control. Yeah, that was pretty crazy. Alright, we'll just stop in for a quick look around the city. Okay. So, first to Heliord, then from Torum to Desier by boat. Okay, I'll try again. Brave Vesperia, fall out! Arr Yuri, I was a little surprised to hear that you're starting a guild. Well, it's not like I'll be doing it all on my own. Did Carol give you the idea? Yeah, but I've been thinking about it myself for a while now, too. I quit the Knights to find my own way of doing things. But I hadn't done anything. What Flynn said to you back in the port town, that got to you, didn't it? Nothing that guy says could get to me. He doesn't like to admit his feelings, does he? No. Don't hurt us now. How's this? Hey! I'm just getting started. Oh, I feel so powerful. Let's work together! This? Nah, this isn't scary!